to solve simultaneous equations graphically, draw the lines of both of the equations, and wherever they meet, wherever they cross, it's a solution to the simultaneous equations, because where they cross, the x's are the same, and the y's are the same. So the solution to two simultaneous equations is where their two lines cross, where the two graphs cross. So what we've got to do to do it is we've got to draw the graphs. We've got y equals x plus 2. So if we draw a table, we only need to do three points. So let's do 0, 1, and 2. If x is 0, y is 2. If x is 1, y is 3. And if x is 2, y is 4. So we do the same thing for the second graph. x and y. Minus 1, 0, and 1 this time. Um, if I did 2, it will take it off the graph. The graph only goes up to 7. So 2 minus 1 is a minus 2, plus 5 is 3. 2 zeros plus 5 is 5. And two ones plus five is seven. Okay, so I'm going to draw the two graphs now. So the first one, zero, two, one, three, and two, four. Okay, so we draw a line going through those points. We're going to extend it the whole way. So we're going to extend it all the way up across the graph. And then the second, and then the second graph, so minus 1, 3, 0, 5, and 1, 7. Draw that line all the way through the graph. So the solution to the simultaneous equations is where the two lines meet. So there, so the two lines meet when x is minus 3 and y equals minus 1. So that's the solution to simultaneous equations. It's where the two lines cross. Okay, here's a different example. We've got a quadratic and a linear. So drawing a linear, we only, we only need to do three points because we know it's a straight line, but a quadratic, we're going to have to draw more points. So we're going to have to do, we'll go from minus 3 to plus 3. Okay, minus 3 squared, that is 9, take 2 is 7. Minus 2 squared is 4, take 2, 2. One, minus 1 squared is 1, take 2 is minus 1. 0 minus 2 is minus 2. And then we're going to repeat, so 1 squared 1 minus 2 is minus 1, 4 minus 2 is 2, 9 minus 2 is 7. So we've got minus 2, 2, minus 1, minus 1, 0 minus 2, 1 minus 1, 2, 2, and 3, 7. So we've got the graph going like that, hopefully. And then the second graph, which is 0, 1, 2. So 2 zeros plus 1 is 1, 2 twos plus 1 is 3, 2 twos plus 1 is 5. So 0, 1. 1, 3, and 2, 5. We've got a solution here, and a solution here. Solutions are minus 1, x is minus 1, y is minus 1, and x is 3, Y is 7. Okay, see if you can have a go at this question. So we've got for the first one, Y equals X squared plus X minus 2. So 
we go from minus 4 to plus 4. And for y equals 2x plus 4, if we just do minus 1, 0, and 1. 4 squared is 16, plus 4 is 20, take 2 is 18. 3 squared is 9, plus 3 is 12, take 2 is 10. 2 squared is 4, plus 2 is 6, minus 2 is 4. 1 squared is 1, plus 1 is 2, take 2 is 0. Uh, 0 minus 2 is minus 2. Minus 1 squared is 1, take 1 is 0, minus 2 again. Um, minus 2 squared is 4, minus 2, minus 2, 0, and we're going to get the repeated pattern there. So 2 times 1 plus 4 is 6, 2 times 0 plus 4 is 4, 2 times minus 1 plus 4 is 2. Okay, now we have to draw the graph. So we've got minus 4, 10, minus 3, 4, minus 2, 0, minus 1, minus 2, 0, minus 2, 1, 0, 2, 4, and 3, 10. Okay, showing up the smoothest curve we can. And the straight line, we've got minus 1, 2, 0, 4, and 1, 6. Okay, so the lines cross here and here. So x is minus 2 here and y is 0. And x is 3 here and y is 10.